Come on in, room 316 here at the Thompson, Washington, D.C. Immediately on your right, you've got a closet, you've got the safe, you've got the luggage rack, a couple of robes, and you've got some uh, slippers, which we did not use. We are checking out right now. We came in from Abu Dhabi last night, spent the day in the city, had breakfast. Dave got us an upgrade. He used a category uh, one through four high at night to stay here. See, immediately after you come in here, you've got your wine stuff, you've got your coffee, uh, your Nespresso underneath here. I think there's a mini bar. Let's see. Or a fridge, I mean. Yeah, a few little things in there. Uh, this is not, we brought that. And then you can see it's, it's a nice size. We actually had a cot in here last night, which funny enough, they didn't set up for us. They just had it kind of upright. Lots of light. Uh, we move things around. That's the bedding from the cot. But you've got plugs on either side. You got your flat screen there. Everyone makes fun of me and says I'm old for saying flat screen. And then all of our towels because we are checking out. And you've got a decent sized shower here. I think this is a fantastic area. I'll show you around a little bit outside. You're really close to the stadium and there's lots of good dining, everything else around here. I think this is a wonderful use of Hyatt points. Rack rates can get pretty expensive, a few hundred bucks a night. Um, and I think sky high, probably like in the summer. This is late October, beginning of November. We are walking out the door. Dave, what do you think? Not too shabby. It's good, good area too. Good area too. Yeah. yeah. What are we like 45 minutes from like the Not gallery yet. and not and all that. Like 25. 25 is awesome. So I'd recommend it. Let's go check out the rest of the hotel. Okay, so this is the lobby of the Thompson. Uh, they'll have water set out for you. It turns into a bar at night, but let's pop up to the roof where uh, it really shines. It's the rooftop, very cool. I had drinks outside, the weather was beautiful. Great summer spot. Wow, that's a big breakfast. Damn, that's a big breakfast. <laughs> DC is just killing it around here. Bringing it. So we popped over here for a little morning walk. What do you think this took us? 15, 20 minutes? Not even. Not long. No, 10 minutes. And you're right at the Capitol. And I think we can kind of meander on around this way. And maybe see the Washington Monument. And then if you're wondering about the location, you're talking about like maybe a 10, 15 minute Uber from DCA without traffic. Very, very short to get down uh, to the Thompson. The area in general has been very revitalized. There's bridges you can walk over. There's lots of joggers, coffee shops, really good restaurants. I really liked it. I was a bit uncertain as to whether I would and how I would feel, but like after seeing it, I really, really liked it. And clearly I went back again. Uh, in terms of getting up to where you can see us walking around, that was about a 20 minute walk. There's one area where you're kind of like walking under a bridge that you might kind of watch out for, but otherwise it's a straight shot. Uh, right up to Capitol Hill, pretty amazing. And then you can, you know, walk all around the gallery and everything else. In terms of getting to the White House or, or the Lincoln Memorial, that might be quite a trek, but you could do it. Uh, there is a uh, a metro stop that's about five minutes away from uh, the hotel as well. But I thought it was fantastic. And of course, you can transfer built rewards or ultimate rewards over to Chase to book this. But for 15,000 points standard, 12,000 when it's off peak and 18,000 when it's peak, even suites, 800 square foot suites are 21,000. I mean, it is a fantastic, I mean, fantastic deal. Um, very good hotel and I would, I would, and I know that I will be back. So, uh, highly recommended from this guy.